Hello everyone, a very warm welcome to Look Gorgeous. This video is all about this look which is inspired from Naira of Ye Rishta Kya Kehlata Hai and that serial is aired on Star Plus. Naira has that kind of subtle look but which is glamorous. At the same time, this look is not particularly inspired from one picture but as a whole like as an overall look of the Naira's face and I took one picture for like inspiration for creating this look right here so if you kind of really like this particular look then definitely give this video a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel click on the notification bell to see more such videos and if you want to know how to create this look then keep on watching this video and before that let me tell you guys that this video is a really special one because this video is in collaboration with shiny which is a very dear friend of mine and more than that she's an amazing makeup artist she creates wonderful looks she's very beautiful and stunning and she's just mind blowing with her makeup looks you guys should definitely check her out if you guys love makeup because she is an amazing makeup artist and definitely subscribe to her channel as well i will link her video down there in the description box below so please have a look on her video and do share some love from your side as well as from my side that would really mean a lot to me after washing up my face nicely here i'm using mui naturals glow serum and you can definitely buy this thing it's really nice it's an insta glow serum and is affordable as well i think its price is rupees 375 and it's very easy to apply it is a serum which is oil based and it has amazing oils in it and works really nicely on skin without making it oily but the, at the same time it just makes the skin really nice and smooth and gives a nice glow as well so uh, that's what i'm looking for here in this video today a nice glow and this thing is perfect for everyday skincare routines as well obviously that's what it's meant for so here i'm using hilari roda gel flower magic lipstick on my lips so as to moisturize my lips and also to give my lips a nice hint of pink tint and after that i'm priming up my face and also at the same time i'm moisturizing up my face and also i'm applying my sunscreen here i'm using dd flaunt uh, bb flaunt dd cream uh, which is from lady raga mag bag of july 2017 and otherwise it's for rupees 800 and something so it's a great deal in lady raga bag july 2017 and then i'm using this oil free swiss beauty primer which is a gel based primer which is very very lightweight on skin and is very smooth on skin so i'm using that and after that i'm using my favorite garnier bb cream i'm not going to do any color correcting or use any concealers or anything like that because i have just molded the look into my own way and i'm kind of making it perfect for everyday looks so every day applying concealers and color correcting doing all those things is not practically possible and garnier bb cream is definitely my favorite bb cream or you can simply say my favorite foundation of all time because it's very lightweight it's medium coverage on my skin and it just gives a very nice and natural glow and also hides the imperfections to like 80 percent extent that i have so personally i'm a huge fan of this and this brush does the job perfectly well the one i used you can buy that from my instagram store and also this mn luxury banana powder you can buy from my instagram store links will be down there in the description box below and this banana powder is just amazing it has pretty yellow undertones which are like perfect to color correct on your face and to set the makeup nicely and it sets the makeup nicely for a long time the puff which comes with it is really nice for applying it and i'm just taking a little bit more on the puff and applying under my eyes so as to completely hide the dark circles that i have and for everyday looks this thing just works perfectly fine it's very smooth and nice fine powder then i'm using my rimmel dark brown eyebrow pencil just filling in the gaps of my eyebrows nicely and gently and 
kind of doing this very naturally without making it difficult and stuff like that i'm just gonna do my quick one minute eyebrow look that's it and after that i'm taking my eyebrow brush which is a thin small angled brush just brushing my eyebrow hair using this and kind of uh, blending the product well into my eyebrows for that natural look and after that for my eyeshadows i'm simply using this sephora 16 color i think it's 16 color eyeshadow i'm gonna be using uh, this thing a light beige with a hint of shimmer in it kind of eyeshadow you can totally use the products that you have i'm here using what i have and what i like and this eyeshadow is bomb the pigmentation is amazing and it's very affordable you can buy yours from sephora website if uh, you can get it shipped to india using some like a third party or stuff like that and i'm just applying it all over my eyelids i'm kind of making a very subtle and nice eye look then what i'm doing i've taken this brown shade i'm going into my eyes crease line with the blending buffing brush and also i'm applying this on the outer v of my eyes and you can see how beautiful the eyes are looking and i'm gonna take the same brown shade onto my lower lash line and applying it to give my eyes a little more dimension so that's uh, what i am doing and then i'm taking young queen sketch eyeliner which is a 36 hour stay eyeliner it's very affordable it's only for rupees 110 applies easily and i'm simply applying it on my upper eyelid like on my lash line no on my upper eyelid yes on my upper eyelid so i'm applying it and a little bit i'm taking it out towards the eyes so as to make my eyes look a little bit bigger than they are then i'm using this makeup forever aqua xl smoky eye pencil in the shade black and i should have applied it very little bit as per the picture that i have taken for inspiration but i kind of forgot that and i applied it all over my lower lash line and also on the waterline but i'm glad that it is not hurting my waterline so yeah and then i have to smudge that lower lash line but i forgot to do that so i simply i'm applying my mascara here i'm using nars audacious mascara and this is one of the most hyped up mascara and it's totally worth it it's really amazing i'm just applying two coats of it and that's enough for my upper lashes to make them look nice and i'm not gonna apply any uh, mascara on my lower lash line i'm just using eyeshadow applicator sponge kind of tip for um kind of smudging the lower lash line then i'm using this coco collection by kylie cosmetics and this is the first time that i'm using this palette uh, and damn it's so pretty and uh, my video is like gonna be up really soon for the review of this palette i'm just taking the bronzing shade and applying it on the sides of my nose naira had that very very strong kind of contouring going on her nose but i'm just gonna keep it a little simple not a very very too much like hers but yes it's still deep enough on the uh sides of my eyes on nose if you can get what i'm saying and then i'm just applying uh, the bronzer shade on my um contour line by making a fish face starting from the ear and ending where my fish face dimple stops and then applying it on my jaw lines like where to hide my double chin and then applying it a little bit over my top of foreheads then taking the same blush that this palette has and i'm applying it on my cheek line for a little nice blush of color naira like has very little bit of blush going on her face very nice and gentle subtle color so that's why i'm just using this one only and it is pink and naira also has that pink kind of a blush on her face going on so and yeah the highlighter i'm using is again from the same palette which is not extremely pigmented but at the same time it's very nice and subtle very mildly pigmented to 
give the face a nice glow which looks really nice and can be carried for everyday looks as well i'm just removing the hr lip balm which i applied on my lips because it's very smooth and moisturizing and i'm looking for matte lips here i'm using matte look velvet matte lipstick in the shade fusion pink and it's a very really pretty and amazing lipstick for rupees 200 you can definitely buy many of the affordable products from my instagram store and uh, using my whatsapp then then I'm just applying this greedy lady shade of matte look super stay non-transfer lipstick and here it completes the look it's really nice I mean the lipstick is really nice the comfortable thing and the texture and everything you might see many reviews of uh, the lipsticks and products that I sell on my channel as well so yes this completes the look but naira kind of had peachish pinkish lips so i'm kind of layering it up with ravishing nude number 30 from matte look super stay range again and also i could have gone simply with powder lipstick in the shade 01 that would have looked really nice on this look and perfectly similar to what naira was wearing but i kind of messed up with these lipsticks and all of these are the ones i wore on my lips are my favorite lipsticks of all time so i hope that this video is not really long and hard for you to tolerate and i hope you guys like it so if you guys like it then please Please give a big thumbs up to my video and also subscribe to my channel click on the notification bell i'm gonna see you in my next video till then take care love you guys love you guys look gorgeous live healthy